Jimmy Garcia after the Southwestern victory. 23-1 for Dallas. Coach, Raven, congratulations on the win today. Thank you. Thank you. So, this is your first SEAC tournament win, uh, first in the uh, second season with the Pirates. Uh, how's it feel to get this win today? It was really good. Um, just the fact that we were able to get through an entire season, uh, you know, it's just an accomplishment for sure. In the fall, if we were even going to have a season, so the fact that we've made it all the way through, um, and in my mind successfully as a team, we've gotten better and better each game. So this just kind of proved how far we've come, and I'm just, you know, glad we've been able to you know, play and practice and be able to make it to a conference tournament. And so, Raven, um, you know, big lead, uh, you girls got up early in the game. Um, how, how difficult can it be to maintain concentration when you get so far ahead so quickly? Or, or is it easy for you girls? Um, it, it's kind of easy just because we have a coach that uh, trains us to settle it whenever we're ahead that much and to like really not force stuff because it's not fair to the middies that have to run back and forth the game when we force stuff. And so coach, uh, the Pirates overwhelmingly controlled the ball off the draw. How much does that affect the game when almost on every single possession you're able to just come off on offense and you know keep the pressure on? Um, more of I just feel like if you have possession of the ball, you have control of the tempo, you have control of, you know, how we're going to dictate the offensive end. So um, it was great that we were able to, you know, give our middies a breather because, as you know, we harp all the time. Play smarter, not harder. Um, it's just no need to force anything, you know. Our middies are working hard. It's a transitional game. Um, you know, let's give everyone a breather. Unselfish ball movement, that's really big as well. It's just. There's no need to force any shots, drive through a group of, you know, defenders crashing. Everyone should touch the ball, everyone should get an opportunity. Yeah. And so, uh, Raven, on offense, big game today, a lot of goals scored by everyone. Uh, what do you expect from the group on offense, uh, your takeaways from today, looking at the game tomorrow? Um, something we've really been trying to work on since the beginning of the season is just like, Passing the ball quickly and keeping it moving so that uh, the, def the defense doesn't have like an easy time like reading what's happening and guarding the one v one. So really, like the main thing we're gonna take out of this game is just like move the ball quickly and, and like pass and cut, move to the open space. Like don't force anything, and eventually like a good shot will be there. And, and coach, final question for you: uh, What will be the keys for the championship tomorrow? Definitely, yeah. Keep it up a hot transition. You know, everyone's got to contribute. Transitioning the ball over. It can't just be one person running it down. Um, lots of passes. Uh, you know, lots of opportunities to move the ball. Uh, you know, work on some plays, defense, really communicating, locking off those adjacents and any cutters. But really, I think what's going to stand apart from what we did well today that I want to transition tomorrow is Colorado. They have good defense. They have high pressure defense. Congratulations on the game today, and uh, good luck tomorrow. Thank, Thank you. you.